Now, the aim is to improve security, but it is controversial. A trial begins at Manchester Airport in the north of England today of a scanner which takes x-rays of passengers. It's designed to show up weapons or explosives which are hidden under somebody's clothing, but it also means intimate parts of the human body will be revealed to airport staff. Fumbling through your pockets, taking off your clothes. Airport security can be a hassle. And so is this the future? On the x-ray image, what you're wearing disappears to reveal potential security threats. But the scanner also picks out the contours of every part of the body. It doesn't leave much to the imagination. Security is first and foremost, isn't it? And that's what we have to consider. Frisking, x-ray, whichever is right for the company, for the passengers, for the individuals. Maybe if I was, you know, 18 and slim and lovely, I'd take it. Mmm, <laughs> it's a bit too personal. Not interested. No, not either. interested no. at all. No. no. That's an invasion on your privacy, if anything. Isn't it? The airport wants to reassure passengers. Privacy, it says, is protected by built-in safeguards. Among them, staff looking at the pictures are in a separate room and can't see passengers' faces. The images can't be stored and no one can take mobiles or cameras into the viewing room. During this one-year trial, passengers can still opt instead for the old-fashioned method, a metal detector and a pat-down. The authorities have carried out similar trials before, but at that stage the technology couldn't cope with passenger volumes. This latest pilot hopes to prove that's no longer a problem. These images may be anonymous, they may bring security and convenience, but some may be a little reluctant to bear all. Tom Simons, BBC News.